day that we heard that Jonathan Larson died, it was one of the darkest days that I can remember ever, but also one of the most galvanizing things that could have happened to us as well. Uh, we we uh, just had our first dress rehearsal, and I was nervous still. I still didn't think that I was good enough. I still didn't think that, that uh, I was getting it right. And that, the, that previous night, Jonathan said, you got it, you, you finally got it, and he was happy. That's the one thing that I remember. Jonathan was really happy and he thought, I really have something here. And we were all thrilled and thinking, okay, tomorrow is our, is our first preview. So, fantastic. I remember getting the call in the morning. Um, I believe it was Jim Nicola called me up. And I turn and I grab the phone and, and I go, hey, hey what's, what's going on? I'm thinking like, um, you know, change the schedule. What's going on? What did I do wrong? Or <laughs> something, something that, that, that we need to adjust. And he told me, uh, Jonathan just died last night. And I froze. I, I, I didn't know what to say. They said, well, you know, um, we all, we're all meeting at New York Theatre Workshop and we're all going to decide what we're going to do. So we were all there and it's the first time also that, that everyone was grieving. Everyone. It wasn't just the actors or, or, or the producers, the people that were involved. I'm talking about like the whole tech crew. Everyone was devastated because we knew that we had something great and that we wanted him to see it. We decided that we were going to do the show, we were going to do the preview, but we were going to um, do it as a reading in his honor to celebrate. And so we're in the table read. There's a part where Mimi and Angel start singing to handcrafted beers made in local breweries, to yoga, to yogurt, to rice and beans and cheese. Daphne and I instinctively start to look at each other. She's at my left, uh, I'm to her right, we look at each other. And she starts crawling like a cat onto the table. And I start crawling onto the, onto the table like a cat. And we start doing our full choreography. And by the end of that, uh, that number, Everybody exploded into complete full choreography. It was just wonderful. It was energy that cannot be contained. We, we decided in, uh, during intermission that we had to go full costume. Basically, we were going to do the show. It could not be contained. We, ha we had to do it. <laughs> we finished off the show and, and, uh, um, and I remember you know, hearing that last no day but today and then I come out and I sit down with everyone and, and after it was done there was no applause it was dead silent and someone from the back said thank you Jonathan Larson it, it's a special show it, it uh, it wasn't just a phenomenon, it wasn't just uh, a financial success, uh, it was a political socio, socio movement, you know, uh, um, it, it, that, that changed lives and, and uh, changed theater and, and changed minds. It, it was an honor to be part of that.